Peter Haddock and I'm here at the Ritchie Brothers facility ready for the next auction on the 29th of March here with Terry Phipps. Terry we've just spent some time together here uh, going through all of the cranes that Ainsco are putting into this particular auction. We've actually seen them working, we've actually seen you setting them up and so have a lot of other people today. We're at the end of the day here. Terry it's really important that you know, people understand the, the amount of effort that you've gone into getting these cranes ready for the auction, but also that they're fully working, aren't they? Yes, they are. Everything is in tip-top condition with them. Uh, as you can see, they're well maintained and the condition of the cranes, you know, they look mean enough brand new, as you can yeah, they do actually, you know, bar the, the fact that their Ainsco brand has come off them for the next auction, you know, they really are something you could potentially see on one of your sites or one of your customers. You've been with the business, Terry, for 40 years, folks. It's a long time to be with a company, but there's a reason for that, isn't it? Yes, Ainsco has um, like a great understanding of the people that works for them and the, the understanding of the cranes, how they may need to be maintained and the high standards they've got to keep. And the other thing about your journey is that, you know, I've spoken to Charlie actually that is in your depot as an apprentice. You know, he's got people like you that actually can help him along his journey as well, hasn't it? It's really important that the mentorship that you have there at Ainsco that, that helps people you know, go through the process that you've been with for 40 years. Yeah, well, the innovations that's happened in the times I've been with the company and other Korean companies, um, you, you'll see that the cranes now is second to none, it's all uh, electronics and everything now. When I started it was all hydraulic pull, push levers. We can pass all them benefits on to these young apprentices and hopefully they take it on and understand what we're on about. Certainly is the, the fact that that's happening there and I think what's really important right now is the fact that you know you're selling these at auction with Ritchie Brothers that the revenue that's going to come from that is actually going to be put back into the business and back into new cranes back into new facilities and equipment and things like that you know as that cycle continues that's really important for the brand isn't it like I see it Ian's course maintenance schedule and all that is second and on so they're getting the full benefits of all that. It certainly are, and I, you know, these cranes are working, folks, because you couldn't, you couldn't put them up like this without that. And I've, I've seen that today, and the guys have really helped me out. It's been fantastic to, to learn a bit more about how a crane is set up, learn a bit more about, you know, Peter, we can do this, we, we can't do that. You need a counterweight to do something like this, and all these different things of, of how a crane actually operates. And this is really important when you've got different pieces of equipment, different reaches, different capabilities. And I, I just really fascinated about the whole journey that, that this has taken and it's great to meet somebody like yourself um, who's actually been doing it for 40 years folks saying it once again because it's great to see all of that skill coming in and also the fact that you're helping out the next potential owners here today that are going to be bidding on it on the 29th of March and great to meet you cheers right nice to meet you as well thank you